Hi folks, Paul Samus on Earth Day, and it's a great time to be alive. And I'm on this little bluff, there's an amazing cutback there with the river. And you can see how thin the layer of topsoil is supporting those trees. And I'm in a special spot because I'll tell you a secret. This is where I've been collecting morels for years. In the middle of these camp sites that have been abandoned, What's remarkable about this, in the, the western slopes of the Cascades in this region, we don't have as many morels as in the burned areas in eastern Washington, eastern Oregon, even in California, where they're very prolific. So we have them around cottonwoods, abandoned apple orchards, curiously, and we have them in burned areas. And so this fire pit has been a place that I've collected morels in the past. Alas, no luck today, but in the course of Hunting mushrooms, I like to pick up trash. I'm quite passionate about this. And what a great thing for you and your family to do on Earth Day. Look for morels and pick up trash. It's a great time to be outside. You can all do, and we all should do our part as Earth citizens to make this planet better. So happy Earth Day, everybody. Not only are we successful in finding some really excellent trash, but we have found <laughs> the, an early morel, Verpa bohemica. And uh, Pam spied this, and then over here, that's her patch. This is my patch. My patch is right here, okay? And so more Verpa bohemicas are coming up. This edible and choice mushroom. This is usually a one week to two weeks before morels. So um, Verpa bohemica, Edible and choice. It's got some other names now, so it's a complex, but yay! Happy Earth Day, everybody.